Today, we are going to address part two of how to heal your inner child. If you missed the first part, then check the link in the bio and go back and give it a watch. Another key part of healing your inner child is relinquishing. We're talking about shame here, and it has a powerful negative effect on a person's sense of self, power, and control as they all come under attack when there's a trigger. It's one of the hardest things to let go of if you've experienced childhood trauma or neglect. Shame can strike out of nowhere. It can affect you in how you perceive yourself as a person. It can also cause you to doubt your self-worth and self-value. It can also make it feel as though you don't deserve happiness or love in your life. Being able to confront, analyse and relinquish the childhood trauma is a key step to being able to move forward and past what happened, so you can then reach your brightest future. Tomorrow we'll talk about part three of how to heal your inner child, so until then, trust the process and it's bye for now.